Hey my lovely unicorns and non-unicorns! Welcome to my third Halloween Nerd DIY. I'm going to show you how to make these super sweet Digimon inspired pumpkin carvings. I pre-made this one which is New Yaromon, it's the in-training version of Gatomon. And in this video I'm going to show you how to make Koromon, which is the in-training version for Agumon. And then Tsunomon, which is the in-training version for Gabumon. So let's do this! <laughs> the things you need today are of course your pumpkins, some knives and maybe if you have an exacto knife for the carvings, your spoon to uh, get the stuff out and also a bowl to get the stuff in there and to draw on your designs, a pencil or any pen you want to use. First step, draw your Digimon onto the pumpkin. Easy right? Now as we have the design on it, we need to start with the actual dirty work. Means we have to take the lid off and scrap out the whole pumpkin. So get your knife working and cut out the top of your pumpkin. So we have to get rid of all the inside you can see here. It's a little bit weird, but it smells pretty nice though. <laughs> you can use those seeds to I don't know, make pumpkin bread. Also you can use actually everything you have inside this pumpkin. So let's start digging in there. Remove the pumpkin flesh from the lid part and of course everything in the pumpkin. I use the knife to cut down the sides a little bit. Now get your spoon and get it all out. You can also use your hands, but well, it feels so weird. Finally, the inside is all empty and carved out, so now we can start cutting out all our design. I started cutting out the bigger outer part pieces. And then we can start carving out the rest of the lines. I used my X-Acto knife. So I cut the first couple of layers of the pumpkin, but you can also use a regular knife. And so we are done! Look at how cute they are! I know it's not really typical Halloween because scary and cute, you know? Anyway, I'm still waiting for Digimon Try. They said it should be out this time, but they obviously lied to us. So in the meantime, you can do that and have some fun with it. This is my last nerdy DIY for Halloween. Um, I will be at the London Comic Con next week, so there won't be a Halloween tutorial coming out, but I wish you all happy Halloween, enjoy your time and see you next time. Oh, thanks for watching. Perla beats for this. So let's do this. As you can see, I already picked out all the rest. Remember, oh my god, you, the series, oh, the, the name of... Hey my lovely unicorns and non-unicorns. Welcome to my third Halloween. The I wow.